Definitely. Um, that's the way we've been successful throughout the year. We're really clear about what's necessary for us and needed for us to go out there and win. Um, so I think the guys generally perform better if they are relaxed in their mindsets and not too tense. And that's partly my responsibility to make sure there's no panic. Um, it is a must-win game. We've played quite a few of them in the last 12 to 18 months and have had a lot of success in those must-win games. So pretty much similar to what we've been doing in the last while. The same kind of approach for tomorrow, I think. We will have a chat now at the, at the field when we go out there to practice. We'll have a look at the wickets. The temptation is always there. I mean, we have 15 world-class players in the side. So we'll have a look at what the, whatever is the best possible 11 for us for tomorrow against India. I'm still in good form, still, still hitting the ball well, as always. And it's just a matter of going out there and doing it. There's nothing I can say here that's going to change anything, except for that I still believe I can. And um, hopefully I'll prove that tomorrow. But I'm, I'm very excited with this opportunity for the team and for myself on the big stage to go and just enjoy, enjoy what we do best, and that's to play cricket and to enjoy each other's company out there. Um, so we're very excited about tomorrow, and I'm also, I, f I feel really excited about the opportunities tomorrow. I don't think guys have been predictable with length. There's generally been a good length for, for many years that works top of off. Um, Charles Callis always jokes about it, but it's true. If you find the right length where the ball's going to hit the top of off stump, it's generally a good, it's a good ball, good length. The grounds change. Um, it's different in Edge Baston. Uh, you've seen Cardiff, different lengths working there, and same here at the, at the Oval. So it's important for us to make sure that by tomorrow, as quickly as we can, we find that perfect length in order for us to hit the top of off more often than not with the odd bounce in between here and there. We have set plans for all the Indian batters, and we've analysed it, it really well through the last few days, and we feel prepared to, to go out there and play well tomorrow. And I'm sure with the experience we have on the side, we'll find the right kind of length and information um, in order for us to, fight, to, to, to be successful tomorrow. It's really important to stay calm um, and not to get over overexcited. Um, the tendency will be there because we all, we all live for these kind of moments. That's why we play cricket. We want to play on the big stage against the big teams. And tomorrow is one of those games. But it's important for us to, to make sure we focus on why we've been successful over the last while. And um, we've played with really good energy in both the games. I felt the guys were really hungry to, to succeed and unfortunately came unstuck in that last game. Um, but... So I'm expecting the same kind of intensity and hunger out there tomorrow, but with a relaxed kind of mindset. I think that's really important to, to remember we're playing a game of cricket, something that we love doing, and to get that smile on our faces out there when we're playing. It's going to be really important, and um, I'll try and lead that from the front.